Now at 10, Massachusetts Governor Maura Healey says she's committed to getting to the bottom of what led to the death of this 25-year-old state police recruit. Enrique Delgado Garcia died last week. He was critically hurt in the boxing ring at the State Police Training Academy. Boston 25 News reporter Lisa Pappas has more from the governor. Lisa, Rachel, it's still unclear which agency will lead the investigation into the death of this recruit, but Governor Maura Healey says she's committed to finding out exactly what happened here. My heart goes out to Enrique and his family and um, and all those two who, who witnessed uh, his death. I mean, it happened at the academy and, and there were a number of people there um, who, who witnessed that and it's just a really hard situation and horrible and not something that you that you ever, ever want to see. Governor Maura Healey says she's heartbroken over the death of Enrique Delgado Garcia. The 25-year-old died from injuries he suffered while in the boxing ring at the Mass State Police Academy in New Braintree last week. Garcia was just weeks away from being sworn in as a state trooper. As governor, I'm committed to making sure that we have a full understanding of what exactly happened and uh, and that we will clearly communicate with the public on that. The Worcester County DA is looking for someone else to review Garcia's death because of a conflict of interest. Garcia worked as a victim's advocate in the DA's office before training at the State Police Academy. DA Joe Early says he'd also like someone outside of state police to dive deeper into this case. I'm looking for someone who can look at this with an independent view who doesn't have a stake in its outcome. After the training incident at the academy, Garcia was taken to UMass Memorial Hospital where he died. Shortly after, police officially made him a state trooper and transported his body with a formal procession. But now many question exactly what led up to Garcia's death. I'm not going to comment on that now until there is that review and, and investigation and until we know all of the facts. The attorney general tells us they are working with the DA to find an appropriate independent investigator. Live in the newsroom tonight, I'm Lisa Pappas for your local station, Boston 25 News.